Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters I hope you are well Sky News has been extremely depressed and sad for the past 2 to 3 days Anyone who had watched their most recent broadcast could tell that the Sky News host was about to burst into tears from the great sadness she was suffering but before you start thinking that Sky News was devastated by what happened in Gaza in the last 48 hours we would like to assure you that this is not the cause for the host of such a show of sadness and the uh, four soldiers that have died have now been named all of them were just 19 years old they are sergeant omri tamari uh, in addition to that sergeant yosef hieb sergeant yoav agmon and sergeant alon amite as i said all four of them just 19 years old as seen in the video K Burley a Sky News host was horrified by the deaths of four Israeli soldiers who were only 19 years old the reason for that tragic deaths was that they were present at the military base that was targeted by Hezbollah they were just 19 years old was mentioned by her twice to emphasize how young they were and in their honor Sky News listed all of the deceased facts and posted their images for everyone to see this is so surprising that sky news is so saddened by the deaths of combatants at the military base but not by the brutal deaths of civilians who were burned to death in a hospital which is considered a safe area everywhere else in the world but not in gaza where was the pain and regret over the news that israeli forces struck the base of al aqsa hospital in the middle of the night when everyone was sleeping where babies small children and mothers were seeking refuge as well as severely injured patients receiving medical care the clips depicting the horrors of that assault were widely shared online and people were struggling to witness the scenes of innocent civilians being burnt alive but sky news and other media outlets do not bother to report such atrocities when they are committed against palestinians during a war military bases are the most vulnerable areas that are targeted by the opponents and those 419 years old had made the decision to be present there and be a part of the military expedition they knew about the risks they were undertaking but what about the kid who was getting medical care in the hospital and whose wrist was still connected to the iv drip while he got burnt alive what about all of those displaced civilians who were present at that hospital and were sheltering in makeshift tents because they thought that hospital is a safe area that is prohibited to be attacked even during wars where was the expression of mourning when it was reported that over 16000 children had died in gaza as a result of strikes starvation or illness since this assault began the sold out media is referring to those soldiers as teenage soldiers as to emphasize the brutality of the strikes of hezbollah that targeted the military base of israel but they call a 3 year old little girl who was deliberately executed by the IOF while she was inside a car with her family as being a 3 year old young woman looks like accidentally a stray bullet found its way into the van ahead and that killed a a 3 or 4 year old young lady so a tragic event these are simply word plays by not only sky news but also cnn bbc and other western sold out media outlets they are aware that they have the ability to modify the narrative at will and they are using it against the palestinians only to defend the actions of their masters the brutality of the recent assault on al aqsa hospital was so extreme that it was unbearable to even see the recorded clips while at the same time the dishonesty and lies of these media figures have fallen so low that one cannot imagine how much lower they could possibly go to please the ones in control of them may allah subhanahu wa taala end the sufferings of the palestinians Amen.